So what we can see too when we work in in uh, Photoshop that pixels are pretty much what we're thinking about and our eraser tool is a great tool to work with to get rid of pixels. So here we have our eraser tool and I'm going to unlock my background here and what we can do literally when we take our eraser is we select the amount of pixels, we select the hardness and we just erase. So there I just went, I erased 180 pixels there's 180 pixels gone. Now the flow is at 51. I'm going to put the flow up to 100. Click. That much is gone. Now, let's take a look if I put the edge at zero, the hardness. I click and you can see that it's um, not a hard edge. So what I'm doing here is I'm erasing pixels. Now, what else I might want to look at in my eraser is the magic eraser tool. We can click and what it does is it's going to select all the pixels that are similar. So if you have a background that's all one color, it's really easy with one click to get rid of things. But that doesn't always work. So for instance, when I click that, I got him, which I don't want. Often what we're going to do with our eraser is we're going to take our eraser and we'll zoom in nice and close and we'll lower our eraser. I often have worked with my eraser at just like five pixels. Um, bring this down and I can come in and sometimes you know we'll zoom in even more and we'll lower our pixels down let's say to three pixels and we can come in and zoom in so we're really just getting rid of those pixels. And there we have it. So what we could do is we could get rid of an entire background, um, you know, and just unwanted pixels that are there. Oops, that's a little bit too big. Once I have this clean edge. I'll zoom in so we can. Oops, hold on. So we can see a little bit better. But that's what it would look like to start to clean out. Then once that edge is gone, then it's easier to get in closer and get rid of this other area. So there we have it. That's the eraser tool.